Hi there, this is Anna Rona. Let's talk about invitations today. Now, the specific kind of invitations I'm talking about are those invitations for you to share your ideas and speak. So I've studied human design for over 15 years now, and we have something called a throat center in human design. And that is our ability to communicate. We manifest through communication and we manifest through action. Okay, but it comes from the throat center. Now, a lot of people have very active mind and they're full of amazing ideas and they just are so excited to share these ideas with as many people as possible. My invitation to you is to wait to be invited before you speak, before you share these brilliant ideas, before you share your experiences with other people. Why do I say this? Well, I learned this from personal experience. When I would interrupt others or speak out of turn, oftentimes I would say things that would land on deaf ears. And it would make me look a little bit out of place because it would not necessarily be relevant to the topic at hand. Now, I, I've been quietly witnessing a lot of people in their lives, and I see this happen over and over again, where people are excited to share things and they just blurt things out. And then it's not received as well as they would like it to be. Now, we all have an important message to share, and I believe we all need to have our message shared with the world because it's important. In order for your message to land to your audience, in order for you to even know who your audience is, just wait for them to ask you to speak. Wait for them to ask for your input because then you know they're ready to listen and to hear what you have to say. That might not be the easiest thing for some of us to do is sit by and wait patiently if we know we have something important to contribute. But give it a try. Try it for a day or a week and start to pay attention to the subtle differences you notice when you share just spontaneously and when you share something because you were asked for your input. I encourage you to try this little experiment. I would love to hear your feedback. And remember, you'll have a bigger impact on your audience if they're ready to hear what you have to say. Bye for now.